this is one of the many gaming products available at Officeworks. The Blue Yeti has been around for a number of years now and it's really well known for its good build quality and its ability to record a variety of different things. It's great for gaming, voiceovers, podcasts and even ASMR. Or is it? Well, I'll be giving you guys some audio samples in this video along with my review, but first, let's unbox it. So cool, this is the blackout edition. It also comes in silver and white in some places. So we've got the Blue Yeti microphone on its stand, the USB cable and some documentation. All right, microphone tour. So on the front of the mic, we have the Blue Microphones logo, a mute button and the volume control for your headphone monitoring. See in the bottom of the microphone, there's a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. So you can plug in your typical wired earphones or headphones and listen to how you sound as you're recording. There's also a thread mount for a microphone boom arm. This came on a stand, which is super convenient, but the sound quality is even better when you mount this kind of microphone to a boom arm if you're doing something like gaming, because it takes it off the table. You don't hear the keyboard rattling while you're recording. Just keep in mind, it's a pretty heavy microphone, so do your research on getting the right boom arm. And we also have the USB input on this side of the microphone. Before I get into the microphone test, I need to show you the most integral part of the microphone, and that is the audio settings on the back. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, there are some negative reviews of the Blue Yeti, but in my opinion, this is a really excellent beginner's microphone and you can make it sound really great if you know how to use it. Let me get you familiar with the gain control. If you crank up the gain, you will pick up a lot more background sound in your room or wherever you're recording. You don't want it all the way to this side because that's full gain. It's gonna sound terrible. Listen with your headphones, plug them in, Check what it sounds like. But next and maybe even more importantly, check the mode that your microphone is set to. There are four different polar patterns that this microphone can record with. And check this out, the box actually has a really easy to understand graphic that explains basically what all the polar patterns are used for. So out of the box, mine set on omnidirectional. Now, if I was streaming with this microphone, doing some gaming, that would be absolutely terrible because omnidirectional is amazing for picking up sound all around the microphone. ASMR content creators love this setting because they can just move things around the mic and it will pick up every single sound. But gamers, podcasters, people doing creative voiceovers on films or YouTube videos or TikToks, you wanna be using the cardioid setting and that's the one that looks like an upside down love heart. Now this means that the Blue Yeti is gonna pick up sound from the front of the mic, which is the logo side, so right here. And that means whether you mount this on a boom arm or you have this sitting on your desk, you want it to be facing your mouth and fairly close to it. So whether it's sideways or even hanging upside down, it's gotta be facing you. Anyway, let's put it into practice and I'll give you a sound test. All right, I'm plugging it into my computer off camera. You'll notice that the microphone uh, glows red on the mute button. That means it's on and working. And when you uh, press that mute button, it'll start flashing. So you know that you're muted. You might want to use this if you need to duck out to use the bathroom if you're streaming. <laughs> okay, I'm now officially recording with the Blue Yeti microphone on the cardioid mode. And you'll notice that if I move away from the microphone, it doesn't sound as good. It sounds really echoey. And that's because again, it's picking up audio from the front here of the microphone. That is like the sweet spot. So I can move away a little bit. It still sounds pretty good it, it sounds really nice close up if the gain is up now that's probably just terrible Ter oh it's not good to see that's just not a good time now I have the bi-directional mode on so if I go over here it's not too great if I go over here it's not too great but if I'm speaking to someone who's on the other side of me it's just as good what well my last hot tip is that if you are using this mic for gaming Make sure the keyboard is behind the microphone. If you put the keyboard in front of the microphone, you're talking to it, you know, it's gonna pick up this sound because it's picking up what's in front of it. So there you have it. In my opinion, the Blue Yeti microphone sounds great and it's an awesome mic for beginners. It's a great all-rounder with its four different polar patterns and it's very easy to just plug and play. Ooh.